Cameron Brink just one block away from tying her career high. In the paint, Daniels goes right at Brink and scores the first bucket of the game. Now Haley Jones gets it inside. Kiki Uri off and good footwork and is able to split the defense for two. Really unique athlete. And Stanford is going to clear the board. These two are two of the best rebounding teams in the Pac-12 Conference. Haley Jones getting in the lane wow. and flips it up. 9-0 run over the last two minutes and change. Haley Jones, how good are you? And she's looking like she's got it going. She's got a lot of confidence right now. Posting on the smaller Schwartz right now. No double team, she'll just flip it up. That is a mismatch nightmare for the defense. She handles the ball. The Stanford defense is absolutely suffocating. We make every shot difficult. Here's Noble with the three, and she hits it. It's impressive that it's hard to count all the time she's gotten that call. Cameron Brink down low. Beautiful offense executed perfectly. Get truly free of the defense for an easy bucket. She's got four. Trying to get it to jump. And now Daniels out ahead of everybody on the run, and she'll put it in. Tough fall by Cameron Brink, but... Oh, right oh, back no. at you. Deadly, the sniper, Hannah Jump, hitting the three. Excellent defense by Jada Noble, moving her feet, stripping Haley Jones. In the lane, if she would have turned around, she would have seen she had a wide open jumper. Ladine steps into her mid-range jumper. The Washington <laughs> offense, it's our own offense. Our own we offense. know what they're trying to do. We're really funny, they both run that shin Princeton. Set. Here's Haley Van Dyke, triggers the three ball and knocks it in. And the Huskies attempts. Ladine feeling it. Heat check oh, going in. Points up and says, you bet. And Van Dyke gets it to her. Can't get the bucket. Van Dyke there. Prechtel with the block. And now Schwartz feet set. They get three. Ladine's been hot, gets it to Daniels, spins oh. it up and in. The Huskies head into halftime on fire. Daniels sees Brink, and that might be the first block of the game, but it lands in the lap of Oliver, who gets an and one opportunity. Take a look at it, definitely gets tipped, or maybe just a little bit short because it's a hard shot. Trinity just grabs it out of the... Four on the shot clock. Oh, Daniels wide open, and she puts it in past the weak side defense. Malibi on the floor. Working on Oliver in the lane, and tosses it to Brink, and she'll spin around and take the bucket with the foul. And Jones with another rebound. Three ball, Dimitri, that was pure. Didn't touch any part of the rim. The last minute. But the Huskies still with the lead by four. Kicking it out wide. This is Dimitri. Oh, that is pure. On the possession arrow. But Brooke Dimitri, three of four from the three-point line. Nine points off the bench. And it is a one-point Husky lead with the ball. It's a big difference when Cameron Brink is in the game. A big part of that run was when she had to leave. Haley Van Dyke, step back, three-pointer is good. Haley Van Dyke in double figures now to join Ella Dean. Van Dyke with 10. Dimitri, another triple try is pure. That's her fourth made three. Off the front rim, Daniels tracking that one down. And now Ladine. Finding Schwartz, pump fake, gets Brink in the air, and then she drops it to Daniels. What a connection. Great awareness. But I ha you have to give credit Lauren Schwartz for her defense on Haley Jones this second half. Haley has not scored in the second half. Dimitri, she's hot, and she hits number five. Shot clock winding down. That one is short. And now Haley Jones has some room out front. Gets it to Brink, and one. And Cameron Brink fired up as she should be. Almost like an assist off of that missed bucket. When Stanford gets that, they're going the other way full speed. These two read each other's minds. 
I think Tara has found an answer at three, especially the last couple games. In it's addition Hannah to jump, Hannah. she can shoot it and she drills it on cue. With a six point advantage. They led by 11 in the first half. And then the Huskies got hot, went on a 16 0 run. Ella Dean was a big part of it, and her hot streak continues. Follows the drive, gets a nice screen from Delea Daniels. I keep that ball way above her head because Delea is right there with her. Oh, Ladine with a steal. Gets in the lane and then just tosses it to Van Dyke on the other side for the layup. Three on the shot clock. Ladine will force it up off the back rim, but Van Dyke tracks it down and now she hits the Ladine that's cutting to the rim. This feels like 2017. This feels like those Kelsey Plum days. Chantel Ozor. Oh, what a move back to back <laughs> buckets. Jones spinning it off glass. <laughs> Noble sees Daniels in the lane. She kicks it to the cutting Oliver, and we are tied. The Huskies have not beat Stanford since 2016. Ladine turns the corner, flips it up with the left hand, and the Huskies have the lead. Would be a huge victory. Remember, on the farm last year, it was a one-possession game with under a minute to go. And the Huskies had a late turnover, and Stanford hung on in the final game of the regular season. And that one is just about going to do it. Jones scores it, and the Huskies need to touch, touch it. it. Right. Or not. Daniels will take it, and the Huskies have done it. The upset here on their home floor. They knock off the number two team in the nation. This is what you play for. These moments. <laughs>